Hello everyone. Um, it's Jill here for Coco Daisy. Uh, I just wanted to jump on and make a quick video about the projects that I've been um, creating with the Memphis Season Kit, uh, the, the uh, November Kit from Coco Daisy. It is um, so colorful and funky and interesting and I've just been having a lot of fun with it. And since I just finished a page that it has some interactive elements, um, and that'll be up on the blog tomorrow. I wanted to make a quick uh, video of that because it's a little easier to see how the interactive elements work in the video than it is in uh, photographs. So, so let's start there and then I'll just walk through a few of the other things I've done with the kit this month. So here it is. It's a, it's a page about uh, road trips um, up north with my niece who is in college here in the, in the town, uh, the city of Kalamazoo where I live. And so since we visit relatives, I visit my mom, her grandma, and she visits her, her parents. Um, I, she rides with me and it's been really great because it's a couple hours of just conversation. So the title is Conversations with Zoe and the first little interactive element which I've uh, secured with um, the wonderful washi tip tape from the kit as well as a little gold brad to kind of pick up on the gold from the leaves and to keep it a little more secure. So that just flips up to reveal thankful for Zoe with a little smiley face for a little playful touch. Um, the date of the layout, which is also kind of important because I write a lot about um, the seasons of our lives and how things have changed over the years. Now we have this kind of relationship now that she's in college. And um, uh, obviously when she's a little girl, she and I had a different bond. Um, and it's just been really cool to think about the seasons of life. And I also reminisce a little bit about my father who has passed away and um, the road trips he and I took uh, when I was in college, when I was in graduate school, and uh, just the great times we had to talk when we traveled uh, uh, to and fro together on that regular basis. Um, okay, so I, I use this wonderful little clip that says grateful, so appropriate. And um, when you take that clip off, then it opens up to reveal um, a page that gave me lots of space to do a full page of journaling. And to include these pictures, one is a little more playful and interactive among the people, and, and then the other is a little bit more of a traditional photo taken on my mom's birthday, which was this fall. And so picking up on the fall theme, the fall time of year, the idea of gathering around this time of year, um, and then uh, I want to do a lot more of these interactive uh, flip uh, elements because they are so much fun and, and uh, they're kind of magical. Uh, Odessa did one that is also shared on the blog so be sure to check that out. Hers is so cool. Involves several photographs. Um, I would like to try that style too. Um, okay just a quick look at some of the other projects I've made with the kit. This one used um, the sketch. Now I believe it's a sketch from this month. Um, I sometimes catch up on sketches from other kits. I just love that the sketches are included in the kit though. This is a really nice one that had uh, three strips of paper and you can do it in any proportion. I ended up doing kind of like this. I'm obviously featuring this paper that I really love. And um, use some chipboard and wow, look at these, these elements. Uh, they're so amazing. The textured rubber leaves, I used uh, three of them on this page about just simple story of fall walks with my dog who's like very furry. So she loves fall and winter. Uh, she's a much happy, happier walker then than she is in summer. Um, by the way, this uh, TN cover is made by a Etsy shop called Repapered. I really recommend it if you love books and you love scrapbooking because she uses scrapbook paper to redo old books and then they become traveler's notebook holders. So um, one, of my, one of my favorite kinds of covers. Okay, the uh, other page I did that maybe you saw on the blog is this art and nature um, celebration using the, the Memphis season. Um, during October, I do like an art challenge and I did it last year too. So here's a photo of some of the art I did related to nature. And then of course, just really glorying and, and loving, glorying in and loving uh, all the colors of fall and, and nature. So I was able to like fully celebrate that with this, this great um, kit with all of its uh, leaves and acorns and um, uh, wonderful embellishments. I love the stamps. I just stamped here through a stencil to create like black and white elements to kind of bring out that Memphis group vibe of the black and white uh, used with the bright colors. 
Um, let's see what else we have here. I think there's one more uh, Traveler's Notebook page. Uh, this one was really fun to do. My boyfriend's very creative, and besides being a writer, he it, uh, dabbles in printmaking and that sort of thing. So I, I have him here with his work table, his setup, um, just this picture that I really love that uh, came from a couple of years ago that I sort of forgot about until I was like scrolling back through as we do. This has a little bit of an interactive element too because this tag pulls out, gave me more room for journaling. And uh, I just used strips of pattern paper. And this little owl was from the um, classified kit. There are such a great complement to the main kits. And uh, this too works with one of the, the sketches that comes in uh, the kit. And it, uh, uh, so many of these sketches I really wanna use again. Okay, one last thing before I sign off and that is Project Life. I've been super, super into it. And I love the cards from the Coco Daisy kit uh, to, to uh, create my spreads. So here's a fall spread. This is uh, September. This is also from the classified kit. These pieces of chipboard that work so great in the pockets are from the po pocket uh, memory keeping kit. And um, the cards are too, of course. And what else do I want to say about this? The stickers are always really great and useful. So are the alphabet stickers um, that I use here and there. Um, yeah. And the phrase stickers. I want to... Uh, uh, show you just a glimpse of the, the facing page as long as you're right here because here again I use one of those wonderful um, uh, 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 embellishments and what else oh yeah the chipboard the fall vibes um, live laugh love and adorable I think those are from the die cuts um, anyway I hope to do a lot more uh, with project life in the coming months I want to do a lot of December daily work um, and then also kind of feature my art projects um, through some photographs and some embellishing um, and use of the, the pocket cards. So stay tuned. I'll probably do another video about that. But thanks for joining me today. Bye, guys.